Hello again, and welcome back to Brian and the Monker. This is a uh, sort of a plain taps for Brian and the Monker video, uh, the YouTube channel. Mostly because I just, I don't know, I, 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 I got to the point where I didn't really want to run champions anymore. I would have loved to have been doing a bunker con uh, today, but I just, I don't know. I mean, it's just the same. Oh, I'll get into the reasons in a minute. But, you know, 21, 22, 23, this is the third anniversary of Brian and the Bunker YouTube channel. It's pretty good. And I did get in one bunker con. Um, yeah, the the hero time sink. I mean, I'm putting in a lot into that, and I was just like the players. They they were showing up because it's what they did. I was receiving. It was receiving a lot of hate for it. I was like, why? Why would I go through this? And then I, you know, as a comparison. I started to run a little homebrew game, way less time in it, and the players seem a little happy because I'm running OSE D and D. It's so much easier. Oh, and um, you know, if you hear a little sniffle, it's a cottonwood drop here uh, on uh, May twenty fourth, twenty twenty three, and my nose might go nuts. And I still don't know how to pause this video. Anyway, so, you know, the players and me, it just kind of got old. And uh, I may have even made a video already saying I wasn't really. I wish I had known about YouTube and making these videos when I, when I was in the situation I am in now. But I was like 20 years younger. Sorry about that. My nose started to go nuts. Hopefully it didn't sound too bad here. I really need to find that pause button. I wonder what that button does. Oh, it just takes a picture. Great. Anyway. Um, yeah, because I mean, making a, making a YouTube and getting the money from the Super Chat... Uh, kind of like on a day off kind of thing. And that wouldn't be that bad. Because, uh, you know, it's not just me who wants to make little comments on YouTube. A lot of people want to make little comments. That's why the comment boards and the chat boards are so popular. And, you know, you, you, you get started at a young age and maybe you can like, I don't know get going and then pay 25 bucks for a guest to show up out of the super chat and um you know if it have him on for an hour and then if if he gets his 25 bucks he agrees to stay for a little while and answer all their questions or, or something of, of that nature talking about D, &D mostly because that's where the money is there's no money in champions but, I mean, what am I going to do now? I, I'm in my 50s. I'm going to start a DD and d channel to where I review a product. So what do I do? I buy a book for 60 bucks, and then I review it and sell it on eBay for like 40 All the time and energy put into that to lose 20 bucks in the hopes that five years from now, I get a check from YouTube for 25 bucks to to cover the cost of that. And for what? So people will notice me? I don't know. Anyway, uh, the future at this channel is going to be recorded videos. I'm not going to change that live page ever. But there, uh, I, I am in, a, in attempting to try to get more Champions content. And to be honest with you, I had a, 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 a viewer pop into my DM this week and... Um, you know, he said, hey, aren't you making any more videos? I was like, no, nah, I kind of stopped. I, I need a break, too. It's summer. Um, I was just spending a lot of time on that. So that's kind of the way it would look is uh, there might be some something in this channel. To be honest with you, 
I probably will just make an, another channel and do D and D content because, you know, maybe, maybe it'll take off. All of a sudden, you know, I just heard that uh, Diversity and Dragon channel say that Ginny D is probably only making five thousand a month, so she's she's putting out commercials for uh, some of the other big. Um, gaming producers. I was like, wow, well, uh, must be nice. So, like I said, I mean, it's oh to be young again, and but to know what I what I, what I do now, and um, be in the kind of the situation that I can uh, do it. But yeah, so this channel's not completely dead, but there's nothing going on there for now. What I'm working on, I'm working on that sandbox for the OSE D and D, and it's in a co GM server. I don't think there'll be any D and D type videos on this channel or any uh, anything revenue. I said there never would, at least not for that Argent game. My champions in my uh, Millennium City 2020 module I'm working on, uh, and I'm kind of in a co GM server there. But we we just started, so I don't know if that's actually going to work or not until it gets a lot. Uh, get a lot more done a lot closer to that winter 2024 winter of 2024 will be the first time you'd see any more videos here probably you know i never really did a book review i think i might have talked about i showed you some but i put it uh so i i bought one two three four five six seven about 12 books and I bet I spent twice what I spent on Fred and the champions and those green dice that I guess are coveted by hero games uh, addicts fanatics dorks because uh, I spent 70 on Fred and champions back in the day so so Millennium City, uh, that's definitely a check. I use that. I use the shit out of that. Um, for me, it was great. Champions Battlegrounds. I ran uh, a homebrew version of a lot of that for my players online, and you you got to see some of that. Um, then the next book was the Ultimate Mystic. Yeah, I don't know. I. I don't think I got my got what I should have gotten out of that. Neither with the Mystic World. There's some decent looking books, but I bought those because I thought I was going to be running more demon, uh, a whole demon campaign. And the truth of it is, I just never got anywhere running champions. I mean, it was just so long once the fight started. Stronghold, I'm getting my money's worth for sure because as it's getting added into my module. Millennium City 2020, which I'm still working on. The uh, Villainy Muck I bought. I haven't even looked at it. I don't know whether it's good or not. It's got good reviews from my players. Conqueror's Killer Crooks. Yeah, you definitely need that. Um, if nothing else, uh, for the disadvantages of the villains. Hero System Vehicle Source Book, yes, that's a check mark. Demon, check, because I did use some of it. Um, the, the Day of the Destroyer or something like that, the big book of the Destroyer. I never used it. I thought I was going to do some more stuff with Dr. Destroyer down the road and the Demon campaign, which I called Hell on Earth. They were going to be kind of like, you know, in it together but not together they would they would be in 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 that campaign but not together champions universe was kind of like reading a, a a history documentary it's like reading a history book of uh, news of the world so that's definitely a check vibora bay is a big check big check if you're looking to get into a setting the book is bigger than millennium city and I think it's better. I mean, I'm, to use a vulgar term, balls deep in the Millennium City. I can't ever change now. But if, 
If I had to do it over again and I was younger, you know, I'd do Vibora Bay instead. Because then probably the magic stuff would matter. Demon, the mystic world and what would would be much more um useful. Anyway, that's that's my my book, so not too bad. Um, so I think that's it for the play taps for the Brian and the Mucker channel on uh, the, the 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 creation day three years gone. Um, at least I didn't get taken down. I didn't get any strikes. I don't know. I mean, we'll see. Uh, did I have anything else that I wanted to talk about? Just give me one second, please. Eh, I don't know. I'm not going to take up any of your time. 12 minutes is enough to say goodbye to a, a YouTube channel with 20, 30 subbed. <laughs> I was told that I had more hours of Champions content than any other channel out there. So, I mean, we, we did do what we do what we could. It's just, you know. I, 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 I don't know how... I mean, I was never really in it to make a buck, but maybe that's the future of YouTube is to try to make a buck. I mean, if I could make a thousand a month on YouTube somehow, I mean, that's be what I do. Well, that's it for Brian in the Bunker. Whenever before have you seen a more wretched YouTube filled with scum and villainy. You fear the dice bags, and I'm out in three, two, and one. Wait, but before I go, thanks to everyone who subbed, all anybody who left a comment, anybody who watched, uh, uh, my players, uh, folks that uh, you know. put me on some gave me some sort of status because i was doing this online and whatnot um to be honest with you you know i i should be uh, what do they call that that uh in the hall of fame at hero discord just because i put on more hours of champions content than any other youtuber uh, anyway that's it i'm out in three two and one goodbye